you, you go into fur harvesters and uh, Zoom trappers and auction schedule results all that stuff is there and buyers education this is where you'll find all of the uh, uh, most of I should say stuff that pertains to board sizes and stuff and uh, pelt preparation and they also sell supplies so yeah check it out okay this is the uh, this is another page in the same uh, area for, from fur harvesters uh, some PDF file downloads and uh, we got the uh, pelt handling manual this large file uh, so and it's a good one and and this is it actually right here so there's a lot of information uh, for for uh, trappers uh, you know you got uh, pelt sizes for handling and marketing removal from traps transportation cleaning and storage and uh, beaver castorium, beaver tails, how to do all that stuff up and uh, in the education department you got the FHA publication which you uh, you will get uh, if you send any furs into that auction, their auction you also got the pelt handling and links to other sites plus there's a mission statement and you got PDF downloads there too, you got pelt handling manual uh, which is uh, this one right here, the grading terminology is a big one board sizes I, got, I just did and uh, how to remove air cartilage, that in itself is a uh, video for sure uh, floating mink boxes, uh, some of the sets too, beaver table, beaver stretch, beaver tail, castorium and martin nesting boxes and uh, actually our Newfoundland we're not allowed to uh, catch martin because martin is on the endangered list there and we do have a uh, subspecies I guess uh, of uh, martin and it's uh, a Newfoundland only martin in Labrador it's a different martin, the same as on the mainland so yeah, so anyway, I hope this information is uh, is good. Anyway, I'll leave a, a link. Uh, there's a link up there and I'll just post it on the uh, on the um, website that I, or on the uh, video that I'm doing there now. Anyway. Yeah, I'm looking at uh, board sizes and uh, stuff from uh, Fur Harvester's Auction uh, in Ontario and uh, they got a listing and, and a nice whack of stuff there on uh, trapping and pelt preparation I don't know if everybody's aware of that or not but uh, I'd just like to bring it to you. Uh, most of my trapping buddies uh, know about it anyway over on this side right here we got the Wolverine and I think Jason gave it a good description of that one on uh, one of his videos recently uh, starts off at uh, 12 inches wide at the bottom and as you can see you draw a center line right on up the middle and you, you got your measurements there so right at the top of course zero and then come down two inches and you got three inches come down six inches and you got five come down 12 inches and you got six and three quarter width and then 24 you got eight and three eighths uh, 34 inches is nine and a quarter 48 is ten and 72 inches you got 11 right on down to the full 8 foot piece and of course uh, I, I use pine for my boards and uh, it's really soft and I split my boards uh, some of them and I also use belly boards but a uh, nice lot of them is split and I got a uh, an adjustment with a wing nut on the bottom down there to uh, to put the proper tension on the, on the board after the animal uh, pelt is put on Links and bobcat, you can see it's two uh, inches down from the top, and it's a 72 inch board. Uh, two inches down is three, six is uh, four and five eighths wide, 12 inches again is five and a quarter, and it goes on down. <coughs> Otter, you got a two inch board, or two, sorry, uh, two inches down from the top, it's uh, three, and three, three and one quarter, uh, six inches down is four and a half, 12 inches down you got five and a half. 24 inches down you got 6 and 3 8, 40 inches down you got 7 and 3 8, and at 66 which is the length of an otter board, uh, 7 and 5 8. And uh, I also got those boards split, but the one thing about those boards being split is you need a wedge to go in between to accept the tail pins, which I do have, and uh, they also uh, serve a, a dual purpose. They can, they can be used as uh, billy boards and wedges. So. I suggest you do that uh, whichever way you want. 
and the fox board is 60 inches long and again you come down uh, 2 inches you got 2 and 5 eighths and uh, 4 inches you got 3 and a half, 6 inches you got 4 and a half and at 12 you got 5 and 1 eight wide. The raccoon board is 48 inches long. Uh, come down 2 inches measure 3, come down 6 measure 5, come down 12 measure 6 and a half, come down 24 measure 7 and come down 36 you measure 7 and a quarter and at 48 inches you got 7 and a half inches wide so that's the total width of the board. So we'll move down down this list right here. I'll leave the link on the on the site anyway. Timberwolf, we don't have them in Newfoundland as well as Raccoon. And uh, what else was there? Wolverine, yeah. But we got Coyote. So Wolverine Coyote board is the same. Timberwolf is two inches down, you got three and three quarters. That board is ninety-six inches long as well. Six you got you got six inches wide and six inches uh, down. 12 inches down you got 8 and a quarter, 24 inches down you got 9 and 7 eighths, 34 inches you got 10 and a half, 48 inches down you got 10 and 3 quarters, 72 inches down you got 11 and 3 quarters, and that's a 96. Fisher or Gray Fox, well you can see, you come down 2 inches, the length of the board is uh, 48, and the board thickness is 7 16th. Most of the boards I got is roughly 3 quarters of an inch wide. And I don't go much less than that. I might go down 5, 8, 7, 16, something like that sometimes. Uh, okay, Fisher and Gray Fox. 48 inch board. You got, come down 2 inches, you got 2 and 3 quarters wide. You come down 6 inches, you got 4 and a quarter. You come down 12 inches, you got 4 and 3, 8. You come down 24, you got 4 and a half. You come down 36, you got 4 and 3 quarters, and so on. The mink boards, basically, uh, you got large and small, and uh, well, there you can see the sizes on, on the mink boards. I think, yeah, right here, and as well, muskrat and squirrel and weasel. So this uh, the bear. I oop, oop the bears, and I used uh, two by four by eight, and I got a video up for bears. Uh, where I did a, a couple of bears, so okay, so that's board sizes.